everybody i'm here just enjoying the weather i'm up here in toronto ontario canada it's really sunny outside i decided to just have some natural light instead of uh turning on the lights in my condo um i just wanted to say to everybody i know you haven't seen me for four months and the reason why is i've just been finishing up a uh, college advanced diploma that is in complementary with the degree that i already hold for many years so i had to do some schoolwork and get some assignments in and do some tests to finish up the program. So I hope you all can understand for the reason you haven't seen me. So I just wanted to say to everybody, thank you for hanging in there. I really appreciate my subscribers for still being, you know, true to me. Um, I'm really, you know, keen on seeing other people's videos and seeing people's exercises and, you know, healthy lifestyles. So the title of this video is pretty much at the gym now I've been receiving a lot of uh, people coming up to me and saying how do you get that strong big O like how are you able to bench 405 or deadlift over 500 pounds and the answer is pretty simple and it's just keep on lifting right just keep on lifting like if you keep on lifting and you are consistent you will get gains it's not rocket science so for me I just go by a simple program which is that I've been following and I've been following all these months I've been still being able to get my lifts in you know in and out even though I'm been going through a hectic schedule now that things are starting to calm down I still try to you know do three workouts a week now I'm trying to up it up to four workouts a week so for me it looks like day one looks like it's a bench day because, you know, you know, everybody knows I love my bench and you see a lot of benching. But I also have incorporated deadlifts now. So it's kind of cool. So what I try to do is I do my warm-up bench and then I try to hit like maybe five to six sets of heavy lifts. And then I might do a little bit of cool-down lifts, like maybe one or two cool-downs. And then I'll go on to deadlift. And for deadlift, I'll just warm up real quick. You know, just go light. You know, start off with a plate. Always start off a plate. You know, for bench, it's always a bar. But I'll start off with a plate, 135, and then I'll go 225. Then I'll do 315 for a single. And then I'll do 405 for a single. And then what I do is I, I pick a weight that I really like, and I try to just hit a volume. And I try to go for, I go for a PR, like a personal record. So a personal record that I just accomplished, and it was really amazing. And I probably could have even done more like I could have probably deadlifted more of it, was 450 pounds. I was able to do it for 10, 10 reps, which is amazing, beltless. So next week I want to try to up the antics. And if I don't do it next week, the following week, I want to do 455 and I want to go for like probably 12 to 15 reps. And I'm starting to realize I don't have to go too heavy with the deadlift. Like I don't have to try to kill myself and deadlift the 585 or 600. I think I'm going to get stronger by just doing one volume set and then I'll back away from that volume set and I'll do like something that's not too challenging for me, which would be like maybe a 405 or 435 and I'll do three reps of that for three sets and then I'm done, right? For me, deadlift, it's simple. So what I'll do is sometimes I'll do a heavy bench and then I'll do a little bit of deadlift and I'm done for that day and I feel good. And then the following day, I'll do some cardio, do some light legs. So I guess what I'm saying, the answer to the question is consistency. If you're working every body part at least once a week, you will get results. Now, some people like to do legs twice a week. They like to squat, especially like two, three times a week. Personally, my legs are strong, and I don't need to do that. I know everybody has different genetics, but for me, work on my legs once a week, I'm good. If I do leg press, great. If I do squats, great. For me, legs is just as long as I hit a nice four to five sets, and I do maybe two to three exercises, I'm good. So today I did legs. I did some leg curls, worked on the hammies. Um, I did some leg press. Tomorrow I plan to do, I might do some more legs, a little bit, but very light. And then I'm going to do my light bench. So for me, I do light bench once a week, a heavy bench once a week, some deadlifts. And I only do like maybe one set of volume that's heavy or medium heavy. And then maybe two or three, not so heavy. So in all in all, for deadlift, I do like four sets. For bench, like I said, I do about maybe six to eight sets. And for even squats, I do like maybe 
three to five sets for three to five reps, that's it. P keep it simple. And cardio is what I'm trying to really up the antics. And I try to do cardio every time I lift. So I'll do cardio after my, my training. Like that to me is important. I'll do 30 minutes. So if I, I do like maybe a, an hour and a half a week of cardio, like every 30 minutes. Like so day one, 30 minutes. Day two, 30 minutes. Day three, 30 minutes. I want to do work out four days a week. So it's going to be 30, 30, 30, 30. And then it's your diet. It's what you're eating. Right? I'm, I'm not going to lie. Sometimes I eat poorly. But now I'm trying to up the antics. So now I'm eating the brown rice. I'm having the quinoa. If, you know, I'm starting to get onto that tip. Having some sweet potatoes. You know, having some lean ground beef if I'm going to have beef. Chicken. You know, cooked nice. Season it properly. Right? I'm not into the pork. Right? That's not me. I don't need that. But I'll have, you know, I'll have my chicken. I'll have my beef. You know what I mean? Those are my staples. Go-tos. Also, I'll have my greens. Have some salads in there. You know, have some tomatoes, some cucumbers, you know, on top with the salad. Or if I'm going to have a burger, I'll put some tomatoes, some cucumbers. Not really too much of the ketchup. I'll have a little bit of mustard. You know what I mean? So eating is important. Also sleep. Got to sleep well. I try to sleep at least seven hours. Sometimes I try to go even eight hours a day because it just makes sense. Stretching, right? And then I'll have my amino acids. I love to have my glu glutamine. And um, I think I'm, I hope I'm pronouncing this right, taurine. T-A-U-R-I-N-E, got to have that. It helps me when I'm lifting for strenuous workouts. So in this video, I'm going to show you some lifts. And I think I'm going to also show my friend Aaron doing a nice deep squat for 405. I was really impressed, so I videoed it. And again, how do you get stronger? Consistency. Consistency, consistency, consistency. And also listen to your body, right? If your body's telling you you're weak today, don't push it. The last thing you want to do is pull a muscle, strain a muscle, and then you're out, you're out in commission. And you don't want that, right? You don't need to do that. You don't need to impress anyone in the gym either. Just do what you got to do and do it well, right? So for me even, I have a workout plan. Every time I do my workout plan, sometimes I up the antics. The following week, if I feel like, you know what, I'm feeling weak, I'll, I'll change up the workout plan. It doesn't have to be like, you know, cemented in stone like it doesn't have to be like you have to do this today no listen to your body because if you don't listen to your body and you push it again you're going to be prone to injury luckily i've never been seriously injured to the point where i tore a pec or you know i pulled a muscle or strained a muscle because i just use that formula right i back off when i'm feeling tired and when i'm feeling strong i'll push it up but i'll always make sure to have that spotter as well too so that's how you become strong just being consistent. So I hope you like this video. I'm going to show you some lifts. I'm back on track. And uh, stay tuned to see what Big O Fitness does next. Peace.
Let's go. Two. Come on. Three. Four. Let's go. Come on. Five. Let's go. Keep it going. Keep it going. Don't stop. Up, 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 up. Sit. That's a wrap. That's a Up. One, two, three. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Come on. Up, 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 up